definitely a weird world that we live in. Here I'm reading about this radio host that killed a rabbit live on air before cooking it. And would you believe the reason? Because below it says the station explained that the host intended to stir a debate about the hypocrisy when it comes to perceptions of cruelty towards animals. Now how on earth do the actions of this radio host actually prove anything, any debate on any stand, you know, taking any stand about the hypocrisy of as far as uh, cruelty towards animals is concerned. This is outright cruelty. Look at the poor rabbit. It is a cute little thing. And how can anyone do such a thing to such an animal? Of course, I always feel that yes, we are selective when it comes to our perception of cruelty. There's no doubt about it. Aren't uh, chickens or goats or sheep or cows or buffaloes, aren't they as, you know, full of life and as much justified in having a reason to live as any of the other animals. It's just the way things have evolved where some animals have become food for us humans, whereby we kill them. And uh, that does not justify the fact that we do it. It's just it's the fact that we do it. Now, good or bad, you know, that's something debatable. Now, I'm just uh, going on top. That says that the host said he killed nine-month-old Alan. This is Alan. By hitting him over the head with a bicycle pump. How does anyone do that? How does anyone do that? See, the way I see it, I see it even when it comes to uh, animals that we eat. There's certain people who do it. You know, there's there are butchers in the profession who do it. Now, you ask me to kill even a chicken. I will not be able to do it. I know for a fact that I will not be able to do it. So, I just want to say that this is no proof of hypocrisy, number one. And this is insanity, absolute insanity. And yes, while we are hypocrisy, hypocritical as far as uh, you know, cruelty towards animals is concerned, I feel it's something to do with uh, you know, profession to profession. It's specific to certain professions, and the fact that the way things have evolved, certain animals have come to be you know, food for us humans. That's the point. By no means do the actions of this radio host justify or prove anything either way as far as this uh, intention to stir a debate about hypocrisy as far as cruelty towards animals is concerned. That's my point.